Warning. The following film features quotes, opinions, and statements that should not be lived upon. Accordingly, Busky Morris and crew must insist that no one attempt to act on any advice provided without extreme consideration. Busky Morris and crew are not responsible for any inadequate lifestyle choices made after seeing this film. Quotes, opinions, and statements in this film should be taken with a grain of salt. Viewer discretion is advised. In the seven years of being an official artist, I've learned a numerous new things, like color theory, how to work with paints, organizational skills, sewing, working on pressure, filmmaking, graphic design, screen writing, of things out of box, sound design, quality, photography, posting, and shading, keeping into everything, lighting, 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 Writing, welding, and woodworking. And I've learned all this at a special college, which holds a special place in my heart. It's called the School of Hard Knocks. The reason why I wanted to make this video is because, in all these years, I've had encountered a lot of people who'd ask me where and if I went to art school. And the moment I tell them I didn't go to art school, they get really judgmental. They'll tell me why I should go to art school or start giving me suggestions. You're not a real artist if you didn't go to art school. They won't take me seriously. So, to prevent that from happening again, I just tell them, yes, I did go to art school. And they'll be like, ah, no way, where did you go to? And then I'll be like, oh yeah, it's in The Hague. It's called the School of Hard Knocks. One of the reasons I'm not going to art school is because I'm already doing it. I'm making an okay living doing art. Some months are good, some are not as good, but luckily I got some side hustles, just in case. And as long as I have a roof over my head, somewhere I can bathe, and some food on a table, I, I can't complain. The fact that they teach you how to apply for a social security check tells me enough about how useful art school is. I'm really grateful that I found a passion that doesn't require a degree. The second reason why I won't go to art school is because I struggle with authority. It's not that I will lash out when talking to law enforcement, but if I have a choice of doing my own thing and being told what to do, And a third reason why I won't go to art school is because of my opinion on the school system. For example, in middle school or high school, nobody taught me how to do my taxes. But I do know how to run a titration analysis. Nobody taught me anything about voting. But I did learn about tectonic plates and how earthquakes are formed. Nobody taught me how to deal with mental health. But I do know that the mitochondria is the powerhouse of a cell. Yes, I do know these are some of the most common arguments, but isn't that telling us enough? And I'm assuming art school is going to be the same thing all over again. If I'd like to learn something new, I'll do my own research and just experiment. And that's another thing I love about the School of Hard Knocks. For some certain career paths, you do need a degree, of course. I'd like my doctor to have a degree. I'd like my lawyer to have a degree. And I'd love my pilot to have a degree. I do agree with the statement that learning things on your own takes twice as long as going to school for that same subject. But perhaps it's just not for me. I'd like to figure out things on my own, making mistakes and solving problems as I go on, discussing issues with others in the field and discovering things my own way. I'm not discouraging anyone to go to school. You should go to school. Just keep these things in mind. But who am I to judge? I didn't go to art school. Or perhaps I did. The School of Hard Knocks.